We're going to taste out some more treats today from our awesome friend, Annie, who goes by Unreal Ranch. Just as a side note, if your uh, vegetable peeler ever gets stuck in the dishwasher like this and it won't come out and you pull it out and it's still stuck and you think, oh, that's awesome that I haven't cut myself yet. You're going to cut yourself. It's bleeding. It hurts. I was screaming a lot of things. <laughs> just, just, just a pro tip. Oh, sorry. The cut distracted me. I'm off my game. I already unwrapped it. So this is Taiwan dessert cranberry nougat. It looks really good. It just fell all over the place. It's harder than you think, but I bet you it tastes, it tastes good. Uh oh. <laughs> okay. I got it. It tastes super chewy, but there's nuts and dry cranberries and it's tasty. Next up, Thin Mints. I always wonder how they can get away with calling them Thin Mints because girl guides, right? It's so funny how a cut can like affect your whole mood. Like I <laughs> like all of a sudden started thinking like, oh, girl guide cookies. We used to be able to get the Thin Mints here. Now you can't, that's so sad. All we get is those vanilla chocolate sandwich ones, which are oh, not so good. My mood just went like that. Let's try Thin Mints. They're upside down. Mm -hmm. It's basically a York peppermint patty. Really, really good. Chocolatey, minty. Really good. Meiji Pucka Snacks. The package is pink and it has a picture of a strawberry, so <laughs> bet you there's strawberry. Oh, oh, they're good. It doesn't give you a lot of strawberry filling. It just gives you a little bit and it's kind of solidified, but it's like strawberry white chocolate. It's really good. Crispy, crunchy, spicy mochi rice nuggets. Say that 10 times fast. So here's how they look. Oh, it's like a little nugget. <laughs> surprise, surprise. Oh, it's spicy. Whoa. Tastes like rice crackers with a lot of heat. <laughs> oh, that was nice to try. It's really burning really a lot in the back of my throat. They're good. Like they kind of taste like curry, but the heat, there's a lot of heat. Mogu Mogu peach flavored drink. I've tried the lychee one and it's really, really good. And the coconut one and the honeydew melon one. Coconut is just okay for me because I'm not a big coconut fan, but I bet you peach would be really good. Mm -hmm. A little pieces of peach. It's fun to chew. <laughs> it's good. Like it's not a natural peach flavor. There's, it's all, it's all artificial, but it's really tasty. Coconut cream wafers. See them? They look like Vortman wafers. Ready? I love coconut taste. Mmm. Mm -hmm. The coconut flavor is there, but it's really, really mild. These are nice. They're crispy. They're mild. They'd be good dunked in like coffee or milk or tea. Last for today, coconut gel jupes. It says a fibrous, cholesterol-free, and delicious dessert. Spend hours of fun munching these jupes. I don't want to eat it for hours really nice. It's sweet and yummy and it tastes like the little bits in that peach drink. Thank you, Annie, so much. We appreciate you. Mwah.